it's a new day. It's your time to shine. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. job that I recently rebuilt Freddy Fazbear's restaurant. Now I'm going to go through some of the things that you'd expect to see during your first few days here as we get started down this new and rightfully exciting career path. Now first, I want you, before we continue, to bust out of your head any myths that you might have heard about our old location. You know, uh, those stories that were in the newspapers a few years ago about the kids and the adult who went missing within our old pizzeria. Yeah, those, those aren't, never were true. The security camera footage from that time period was oddly missing, but there were no clues that suggested someone inside the pizzeria did the harm towards them. One of the detectives was so determined to end the case that he accused that one of our own robots was the possible suspect. He was truly out of his mind, so we had to get rid of him and so did the police. Anyway, that is, that, that bit of bad business aside, we decided to close down the pizzeria and open this new restaurant because of the bad image. The case was never solved, but you can have my word that the robots are completely harmless. To ensure your safety and comfort, however, we installed a few security measures. These are the these are those blind spots on your cameras that are right outside your door. We installed lights and buttons that unleash a controlled shock there, so you can deal effectively with any potential robbers or whatever might be out there. As for the vents leading to your office, we installed a temperature control. Our both vents are made out of entirely different metal, making the left one effective against threats only if the temperature is hot and the right one if it's cold. For now, that should be all you need to know. Be sure to finish your tasks and have a great night.
just have to tell you about some things while you're here for a week, five days? Uh, well, you'll be here for a few days, that's all I've been told. Anyways, your job is simple. You just have to make sure everything here is kept safe until the new animatronic is here, so we can shoot the more modern commercials. It should be relatively easy if they weren't that, well, the characters have a bit of a problem. They walk around sometimes. Now, they're naturally not supposed to do that, and we've already tried to find out what causes them to move around, but it just creates one of the temptations to get a broken arm. And, well, I don't think I should tell you the rest of that. That shouldn't be a problem for you, though. You only have to look through the cameras to check if they're okay, but in case they do move around, there's a so-called corrupt button that will make them stop running, because if they come too close, they might try to hurt you. Uh, in the matter that they do come too close, just don't move. They don't seem to be able to distinguish you from the surroundings. That should be everything. Well, good luck and I'll talk to you tomorrow.
in the other part of the building that we forgot to install yesterday. Sorry about that. You might want to check on camera 9 from time to time. Something in there seems to cause the power to turn off after a while. Well, we tested the system again and noticed that the corrupt button doesn't work on camera 6 for some reason. There seems to be a wire cut or something. Uh, we checked inside the tent there and we saw another character inside of it. We don't know what to call it, but it looks like a pirate captain guy. It didn't seem to work anymore, so we fixed it up and it mostly works again. We're going to look at the building tomorrow still to see if there are any more characters that we can set because we got to get up to a different location so that they can be reused for something else later. Well, that should be all for tonight. I'm not sure if I can record a message for you tomorrow, but I'm going to try to make one for you, just in case you find anything new the day after. Have a good night.